Hi, I'm Gwen Schoen with the Sacramento Bee, and today's craft project is a fountain that you can make to go in your garden, or you can make a small one to go on a tabletop. The way you start is first buying a pump, and pumps are sold by how far they will pump the water. For a small fountain, one that will go 12 to 24 inches is perfect, and you can get these at just about any craft store, or fountain store, or uh, home supply. Most pumps don't come with a, a rubber hose that attaches to the pump that pumps the water up to the top of the fountain. So check the pump when you buy it and see if you need to buy an extra hose. And hoses will cost you about 50 cents. The pump will be about 12 to 15 dollars. The base of your fountain just needs to be deep enough to keep the pump completely submerged in water. And it can be anything that won't rust or leak. I wanted to use a flower pot for the top of my fountain and the bottom of the pot had a hole in it so I bought a cork that I could put in the bottom of the hole and run the hose through that. The idea is that I'm going to build the base of the fountain up with uh, cobblestones, rest this pot on the top, then the water will run through and spill into the cobblestones. Now the cobblestones that I bought, I got at a brickyard, and I could buy a big bag of them for about $4. And you could, they generally will let you go through and pick out the ones you want so you can get the colors and shapes that you want for your project. It's easiest if you build the, the fountain at the location where you're going to leave it because once it's all assembled, it'll be too difficult to move. The first step is to place the pump in the bottom of the bowl, attach the hose to the only opening that there is on the pump, so that's easy to figure out. Put the pump in the water, and then because I'm going to fill it up with cobblestones and I don't want to use all my stones, I'm going to use an old clay pot in the middle just to fill up some space. Now I'll take the pot that I want the water to spill out of and place that on the side and fill in the rest with my cobblestones. Now you can add a few water plants if you want and if you buy those, I recommend leaving them in the plastic pot and just putting the pot in the fountain and that'll keep your pump clean, won't get dirt in there. So the plants, just make sure you use water plants that are designed to live in water. So keep placing rocks in the bowl and the pot and arranging the hose until the water is flowing exactly the way you want it to look. 